Welcome back to a new video of mine. I'm currently in my room in Germany, um, as you can maybe see from the background. But yeah, um, <laughs> I'm here. And um, yeah, in this video I thought I'm going to talk about like my plans, like what changed, what I've done until you saw the last video of mine. So it's just going to be like a quick update basically in my life. So um, yeah, I've um, had a really exciting and really fun time until now. Basically the last video you saw of me on my channel was when we were traveling down the west coast. So that's like, I think we arrived in like November, so that's like, it was like two months ago now, or like six, yeah it was two months ago now. And after that we arrived in Margaret River and um, yeah we just moved into a house together. We had a really really nice house. Um, the yeah the rent was pretty cheap we paid a hundred dollars per week which was really nice we lived with all our friends so that was good and um, yeah while we were living there I was working in a pub called Cheeky Monkeys and it was really nice to work there I really liked the job it was good money so I worked there with a um, with Beth so like a really good friend of mine and yeah we basically just done that and um, we went to the beach quite a lot. Um, I can insert some photos and like videos here, but it was really, really nice, and I'm really glad we spent that time in Margaret River. And I wish I could like, like I would like to go back there at some point and um, just like live there again because it's like a really nice city. It's two hours south south of Perth for or like three hours south of Perth for everyone anyone who doesn't know where it is. It's a really nice city, so definitely recommend going to Margaret River, and um. Yeah, so I've done that for, um, for how long? I think for like six weeks, probably five, five to six weeks. And then I decided to come to Germany. So that's where I am right now. Um, yeah, <laughs> I booked my flights like really last minute. Um, I think I booked my flights in October. So they only had like shit flights left. So I had to... I took the cheapest one, which was like three, like I was, I had two layovers or like two stopovers and then um, I had to take the train from Frankfurt to Leipzig, so that's where I live, it's like one and a half hours southwest of Berlin, so that's why I'm right now. I made it! So yeah, I've done that um, and traveled back to Germany just because of like a lot of personal reasons um, there was like a lot of stuff like going on here so I had to come back so um, yeah um, it was a really long and difficult journey to get here but overall I made it and wasn't too bad so that's all that matters but yeah so yeah that's how I made it to Germany um, what am I doing here so Basically, I just spent three weeks here, so I, I am going back to Australia, but I spent four weeks at uh, three weeks here um, Just had time with my family didn't see any of my family or friends for one and a half years So um, I spent the time at home. We celebrated Christmas like my parents and I went to um, like a town in Germany and um, which was really nice so we spent Christmas there and then um, yeah I spent lots of time with my family and um, friends and I celebrated New Year's here so it's the 2nd of January 2020 I think um, so yeah it was a really nice time I still have one more week to go so I'm still gonna go to Berlin to visit friends over there and um, yeah, I'm just gonna have a fun time basically. Um, but that's that. So um, I came back for three weeks um, just to see friends and now I'm going back to Australia. And my plans in Australia are, so basically um, I always wanted to do an internship in digital marketing and I've done like a online course and like online marketing. So um, yeah it was really fun and I really enjoyed it so I was thinking why not like give it a go in like a real 
like business so I'm trying to get an internship um, in that field so we will see how that goes so um, yeah that's what I'm doing and um, I'm flying back to Perth and then I'm going to Rotten's Island with my boyfriend and yeah we don't really know what the plans are because I don't have like a set internship now uh, yet so I kind of, I'm ju kind of just waiting for replies, but um, that's the, yeah, that's like the overall idea. So um, we will either stay in Perth or around Margaret River for one more week and then drive down. So take the car and do like a road trip from like Margaret River to Melbourne, which would be quite far and I think everyone is like familiar with all the bushfires going on in um, Australia so we don't really know if it's the best idea to like do a road trip through Australia right now especially through that bit but um, yeah either that or we might have to sell our car and fly um, so we're gonna do one of these two things and then I'm gonna be in Melbourne for um, yeah I think end of Jan, February, March, April probably so that's going to be really exciting. Um, loads of my friends are there right now, so I think it's going to be like a really fun time. So um, yeah, the plan is that I'm doing an internship through that time. And then, yeah, then the plans are that we're buying a car there and then do a road trip from Melbourne to the Gold Coast and then just live and work on the Gold Coast for a bit because my boyfriend is really into surfing and they're like all the surf competitions on. So um, yeah, we're gonna do that. And then um, I already spend time in Kalanara. You maybe saw my 88 days um, of working on a pumpkin farm. If not, I can link it in the description below. Um, it was a really hard time, like working on a pumpkin farm. Oh my god! I, like at the in the first week, I think I cried like every day. But it was a sick time just because of like the hostel and the people there. So um, I'm, we're thinking of going back and just like doing different jobs. Like a friend of mine work in childcare, so that would be sick. Um, so yeah, we're thinking about doing that and. Um, yeah, then we will probably stay there for a bit and then just see wherever it takes us, really. And then on the 7th of October, my visa expires and I have to go to... I have to leave the country, basically. So um, I think we're going to go to Bali for like four weeks, maybe. And um, yeah, just chill in Bali. I've already been to Bali, so I'm not going to do like all the like touristy bits, just like nice bibs and bobs. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's the plan. And then it's time to go back home, but I don't really know if I want it. But yeah, it was really nice to be back. But it was also really weird coming back just because like everything is different, but everything is still the same, if that makes sense. Um, like all my friends like moved to like different cities to study and but everything here back home is still the same. Like I've seen my parents and it felt like I I haven't seen them for like two weeks maybe, even though it's been one and a half years. Same with my grandparents or like nearly every single friend of mine. It just like didn't feel like I was gone for that long. Um, which is really nice because now I know I can like keep traveling and it will always be like easy. Um so yeah, it was Weird coming back in that sense and then also I've been living on my own for one and a half years now and now I'm like here for like three weeks now in my parents' house. So um, obviously they have like their own rules and their own ways of like doing things. So that was a bit difficult as well. So I probably like when I come back to Germany I will probably not live here anymore. I'll probably move out. Um, but yeah, that's um, the whole update now and um, things always change like I made so so many plans and it never really worked out other than once when we went to Tasmania because we already pre-booked that like trip. But yeah, that's the um, plan. I don't know if it will work like that but I hope everything will, especially with an in with an internship because I would love to do that. 
So yeah, I'm gonna spend another 10 months in Australia and I can't wait, it's gonna be sick. But yeah, if you have any more questions or any ideas for videos, just leave me a comment below and give me a thumbs up.